Merry Christmas, everybody. My name is Bobby D, and welcome back to Don't Fret. I know it's been a rough year. COVID touched most of us in one way or another. So, one thing, one thing that people did pick up during this lockdown was the guitar. Uh, guitar sales are way up, and there are a lot of people that would probably like a gift from their significant other for Christmas. And I've also had comments asking me about Christmas gifts for guitar players. So let's get into it. First, you can't go wrong with strings. Every guitar needs a string or you can't play. I prefer a Lexer. Oh, and by the way, I'm not involved in any of these companies. It's just things that I used and works for me. All right. They're great stocking stuffers. $15 a box. You can get them Sam Ash. Uh, guitar Center. Also, we have a cleaner, Dunlop. They make kits that have cleaner, waxes, uh, even cleaners for the strings. $20. You can get it in any Sam Ash store also or Guitar Center. Made by Dunlop. Good product. All right. Also, here we have a pretty cool capo made by Thalia. They give you this nice little bag to keep it in. Also, a plastic case. The reason I really like these capos, they're easy to use while they are on the guitar. You can slide them down from fret to fret with one hand underneath, like so, just by pushing that back part, like that. And you can change the capo right in the middle of a song. Okay, they're beautiful looking. And also, it's a small mom and pop shop that started this company. So, I believe in supporting them, especially in this time. Picks. You can always buy an assortment of picks. Again, Sam Ash, Guitar Center, they all sell them. Cheap. Five bucks. Nice okay, guy. speaking of picks, we also have a pick holder. Looks like a guitar. Little button to open it. And you can keep all his picks in there, or her picks in there. Another nice little novelty for a guitar player. I know as a guitar player that they don't want to be bombarded. I didn't want to be bombarded with a million gifts, you know, that just sit on a shelf. So the things I'm showing you are useful for a guitar player. Oh, here's a little thing my wife bought me. Stays on my keychain, leather case, and inside is a metal pick. And it says you can get it inscri inscribed. And it says, after all these years, I'd still pick you. Isn't that cute? All right, and this is from Etsy. It's E-T-S-Y. It's an online company. And it's another small mom-pop shop that we like to support. We're not affiliated with them. But it's called, again, E-T-S-Y. And I will have the store's name down below in the description for this product also. All right. All right. Speaking of picks, we have a pick puncher. Okay. Pretty cool little thing. I used it. Cool thing about this is it looks like a giant, giant stapler. What you do is you can put any plastic card you have in here through the front here, slide it back, press this down, just like a stapler, and bang, it pops out a pick. I have some examples here. Here's a prime card pick. Okay, I use my prime card. It makes a pick out of a prime card. This is how we cut up our credit cards in our house now. Here we go, there's a Visa card. See, we turn our nasty Visa cards, credit cards into picks, something we can use. You can recycle. You can put your driver's license, an old driver's license in. Your significant other could put your driver's license in here with your face, cut it out. The pick, your face is on his pick forever. All right. If he changes his strings a lot or she changes her strings a lot, here's a little winder. All right. You put it on a tuning nut to tune your guitar. And instead of doing it your fingers and it takes forever, this is a little faster. All right, you wind it. You can unwind your strings when you have to change strings. 
Cost five dollars. Makes it a little easier to change strings. And when you go a little more, if he changes his strings, if he's anal, or she, he or she is anal, and they change their strings once a month, then you get him this electric one. Same thing, you put on the tuning nuts, and it'll loosen them right up for you. It's like a little drill. Another thing, 20 bucks. That comes with a charger. Very nice gift. Okay. Also, here is a personalized strap. Bobby D from Don't Fret is also from Etsy, the company online. Great company. Okay, the important thing about this strap, not only is it personalized, you can put any name on it, this part here with the name comes out, all right? If there's a couple other designs he or she likes, say lightning bolts or dogs or cats, you can pop these in and out. Very now, cool. if you're a real good Santa Claus, and if you know someone who's been a very good boy or girl, this little guitar parlor, guitar from Epiphone, it's 200 bucks. Comes with a speaker, bag, extra strings. Uh, it's a beautiful little guitar, especially for someone who's just starting out. You don't want to waste a lot of money on because they might give it up. It's a nice little guitar. 199 Sam Ash. Epiphone. Now, if you're a real good Santa Claus, and they've been real good boys and girls, you can get them a nice tailor. This guitar... It's $3,000 worth every penny. Remember, if you're buying someone something expensive like this, they're going to have to go to the store and hold it, touch it, feel it. That's how a guitar player knows what guitar he likes. You can't just buy a guitar and come home with it because it might not fit the person. So make sure, you know, you stop and Sam Ash with the, your significant other, you know, and just watch what guitar he picks out, you know, that he likes and surprise him. Him or her. Unless they sent you a link or a picture or gave you the model number, this is a Taylor 714C. Expensive guitar, but it's worth every penny. Sounds beautiful. All Don't right. forget to shop Craigslist and online, Amazon, eBay. You can get guitars cheaper. All right, last but not least, we have the Bobby D Guitar Cup. All right. I'm sure we have a million mugs. I have them. Everything I do, my wife buys me a mug. If I sing, she buys me a mug with notes. If I hunt, I get a mug with guns. You know, so it's the million march mug, mugs, I guess. I don't know. Anyway, it's another nice gift. But if they have too many mugs, forget the mug. All right? But it might become their favorite mug. But it might become their favorite mug. All right, everybody, I hope this helped you buy your significant other a nice guitar Christmas gift. And until we meet you again, may God bless you. Adios.